Hello, this is Dr. Song Xu of Keysight Technology. In next video, I'm going to demonstrate you how to set up to run contact mode imaging. Now let's do contact mode imaging. First, you go to the imaging mode in the software and choose contact AFM. Notice when the software is in the contact mode imaging mode, the laser alignment window shows a yellow dotted line. That's a reminder that you should align the detector so that the photo red dot is below the center line. Here, the red dot is at negative 4.4 volt. The next is go to your servo control window. Set your set point 2 to 4 volts higher than the deflection signal. Here, the deflection signal is negative 4.4. Let's put the set point at negative 0.4. Now we are ready to approach. Here is the approach symbol here. Click on it. The sample will move towards the tip. The approaching progress window shows up and also shows how much distance the sample has traveled. Depending on approach speed, this process could take several minutes to 10-20 minutes. Now this window disappeared, that means tip and sample has engaged. Next is go to your imaging window and set up so that you have topography, deflection, friction, and if you have extra channel, you can set up whatever you want. And here I put topography and retrace window. Next thing is to optimize the integral gain. Here go back to the Z control, the servo control. Start with the integral gain about 10. And now we're ready to scan. Come to the scan window right here and type in the scan size scan angle, XY offset, and scan speed. Here, the rule of thumb of determining the scan size is that the feature you want to look at and times 5 to 20. Now here, this is sample has little rings that is about 100 nanometers, and therefore we could image at the 10 times 100 nanometer, which is 1 micron. So we use the scan size of 1 micron and we're going to image in the center of the scan range, so XY offset is 0. And we will image at 0 degrees of rotation. Speed is 2.03 line per second. And then we use pixel number of 512 by 512 pixels. Click Start. And the image starts to appear. You can adjust the speed and IP gain during the imaging. Now, in order to save your file, you need to set the file names. Go to the real-time image window, open the pull-down menu of file, and click on set file name. Here, you could Make up a new folder, AFM data. And put a file name. Here is Alumina. And click Save. Remember, when you click Save, the image is not saved yet until it finished one full frame of scan. And here on the file, also choose Auto Save Every Frame. And therefore, every time when the scan finish, this image is saved under the set file name.